It is a big competition in Manchester tonight. Drum Corps International is the major league of marching band competitions, and they are at Memorial High School. As WMUR's Jamie Staten reports, the show is a chance to catch one of the best bands in America, the Nashua Spartans. So what exactly is Drum Corps International DCI? It's been described as high octane all-star marching band. These musicians are basically running a road race, throwing in some gymnastics on the field while they carry their drums and brass instruments. It's described as in your face and it's awesome. The DCI summer tour is in full swing and the Granite State takes center stage tonight. Many of these college students are music majors and there are talented high schoolers as well. DCI is the major leagues of marching band basically. Um, it's awesome, I love it so much. And to be part of this team, the Nashua Spartans, you have to be in shape. It's, it's like marching band, just a lot harder. There's a lot of running around, you're moving really fast the whole time and it's, just, it's a lot of work but it's a lot of fun. Each of the band members pays nearly $4,000 to be on the team. The Spartans are traveling 8,000 miles this summer with six buses and three tractor trailers, playing 22 shows across the country. Tonight, DCI New Hampshire features seven bands from across the U.S. and Canada for the Nashua Spartans. It's a great tune-up before they head to the national championships in Indiana. If you do anything for 12 hours a day for 45 days straight, you're going to get really good at it. So that's what these kids are doing right now. We have a very weird show, it's very wacky and fun, and it also, it's also very high energy and high paced, so I think they're going to absolutely love it. And this is a competition tonight, we hear it could come down to the Nashua Spartans or the California Gold. The Gold spending $40,000 in plane tickets to bring their team to the East Coast, so you know they're in it to win it. The show starts at 7. In Manchester, Jamie Staten, WMUR News 9.